Top 10 Reasons I Love Blender 3D artists often get passionate about the software they use. This makes sense, since it takes so long to get good at a particular piece of software. Artists naturally develop strong feelings about what they love and hate about their 3D software. With that in mind, here are the top 10 reasons I personally love using Blender. Number 10. Workflow Speed Although Blender is often criticized for having an interface this complex and just plain weird, once you get to know the hotkeys and how the interface and layout works, you can get things done with incredible speed in Blender. The initial learning curve is steep, but once you get towards the top, it's very rewarding. Number 9. Hidden Tools No matter how much I think I know about Blender, it's always surprising me. Every few weeks I stumble upon a new tool hidden deep within the interface that opens up new abilities. Such tools would be touted as major features in an Autodesk product, but in Blender they are tucked away like Easter eggs in a video game. Check out the Ivy Automated Lip Sync and Pose Library add-ons just to start. Number 8. It's cross-platform. Although this does not matter that some people are exclusively Mac or PC, many graphics professionals have to work in environments that mix many different platforms. The fact that Blender looks and acts almost exactly the same on every platform is a bonus. Number 7. New features add awesome new tools, not just incremental changes. In most software, major new releases are promoted as being uh, game changers in the capabilities of the software, but end up being nothing more than bug fixes and a few minor improvements. Blender updates often include entirely new tools and workflows. Number six, simulation tools. The simulation tools in Blender are normally sold for thousands of dollars as plugins for other software. I'm looking at you, Autodesk. The smoke simulation itself would cost half the price of a 3D Studio Max license in the outside world. Number five, all inclusive feature set. It's safe to say that no 3D software on the market has all the capabilities of Blender. That's not hyperbole. Blender includes comprehensive modeling, animation, compositing, simulation, game programming, even a built-in video editor. And ours could, technically, create an entire film from script to final edit using only Blender. Number four, character animation tools. Being that my primary interest is 3D, uh, in 3D software is character animation, I really appreciate how comprehensive and flexible the character animation tools are. There's still much, much room for improvement, but the armature system allows an animator to set up and animate a character fast. Number three, the community. This is not a touchy-feely, I love you guys, Blender users rock, circle jerk. A thriving, helpful community is extremely useful to learning the software as well as overcoming the inevitable bugs. For some software I've used, the community was either very small or, or, and did not have the answers to even basic questions or were actively hostile to anyone asking for help. Yes, you should RTFM. But situations will always arise where you're going to need outside help. A sparse and or negative community can wear on the user and make them search for other software. Number two, no copy protection. Oh, and it's free. Wait, it's free isn't your number one? Actually, the fact that Blender costs no initial money is not as important as many of the other features on this list. 3D software prices have fallen to the point where most users can't afford to pay for the software. What is important about the fact that Blender costs no money is that there's no copy protection or intricate licensing schemes. If you work from home and have only one system that you rarely upgrade, then this isn't as big a deal. But in the professional world, you are often swapping out new systems. Even a simple system update can cause some licensing servers to not work. This can cause you to not be able to use the software you paid good money for, and often at the absolute worst times. And the number one reason to love Blender, it's open source. This number one uh, may come as a strange esoteric choice, but once I thought about it, the fact that Blender is open source software is what enables all the previous nine points. Because Blender's source code is open to the public, the best minds of the world can add features to it at any time. Also, Blender is not beholden to market forces. Features can be added without the need to pay for large teams of programmers, making the final software able to stay current and integrate cutting-edge technology at all times.